Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge. It is the 17th of April and a challenge Saturday. Today we're killing three glitchers officers while killing as few other people as possible. We are technophobe, which is not great. Tough, which does not matter. We've got a conch hammer, which is helpful that we can't bash dash with it. And we got a, three uses of a crash beam and five key clones. That's actually quite good. With five of them, I feel pretty comfortable with spending at least one or two on the first two ships. That's pretty good. Off-world Angel is nice to have, but not anything essential. And with that, let's go. Okay, we've got emergency shields. We want to take them out first. Getting those extra wrenches will be nice. Random kits and light reinforcements. We pretty much want to save the crash beams for just in case the targets. We want to save them for the targets in case they have like shields and stuff. Uh, only one door. Reinforcements, so it's not tightly orbiting anything. Yeah, we've only got so many crash beams. We want to save them for when it's really necessary. Just missed it. Still got three seconds. All right. So that's pretty good. I'm already missing the bash dash. So we can go around a bit. Get that crate. Wish the key was sooner so I could get that crate. But, oh, I have to go out of my way for that one. That might be worth a key clone. Mm. Oh, you know what? If I go down here, can I key clone that? That might be too far. So that is one. It's over one and a half. That's one, that's slightly over one and a half. But I don't think that's going to be enough. If I go down here, I can steal this key. But then have to travel further to get to the target. Hmm, that's a difficult one. Well, let's start with room number one. Do I care about reinforcements? If I'm not going this way, I don't know if I do. No, I'm walking. So that means the defender has plenty of time to come down here and mess things up. So it would be nice. It might be worth using a crash beam to get a shotgun from the defender. Because that's concussive. Ooh. Okay. That saves some time here. Because I just have to throw this at you. Alright. Yeah, definitely go for this crate. It's so close to the beginning. A visitor, that could be useful. Um, what's the fastest way out of here? Yeah, it looks like it is that window. And as we go past, oh. All right, well, we can just steal that key then. Thank you, game. Keep an eye on that. Don't want to walk into a sentry gun. Okay, yeah, that's definitely worth one of our uses. And then we can speed ourselves up a bit with a bash. And now we're right next to this, so... Hurrah. Okay, we've got more crash beams. Nice. Uh, Defender is coming down here as well. That is good. Let's 
get the pod moving a bit. Don't need to be super precise because it is the angel. Hello. Bash and pick up so you're close enough to kill. Kill, catch, canopus. <laughs> oh! I'm not gonna bother with that wrench. Uh, two conk hammers is generally more than enough. Alright, need to make sure we don't use the conk hammer here. Use the short range one. Don't want to accidentally... No, actually, we do want to use the conk hammer here. <clears throat> if the defender was more... Over here, we do not want to use the hammer because they would break the window, but we do want to use it here because it knocks them out of the room, so that way we don't have to worry about catching them. Replace a wrench with that. That did not knock him out of the room as far as I wanted him to go. There we go. And then we're still very much in line with the angel. And emergency shields, those can be nice. Alright, and we can shoot out the window. Having a gun is nice. Alright. Got lucky with the guard with the key holders patrol there. And also lucky that the defender went down. So good times, good times. Okay, we've got shields. That's gonna be one of our crash beams, heat sensors, target fleas. Alright. Uh, they're a bit close. That should be fine, though. Hit the, 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 the. Oh, that was awk. Oh, God, that was awkward as hell. I think I was too close. I think I, I think I didn't go far enough away. Okay. So I could dodge bullets. Let's see. One. And a half. I might be able to steal that key. I don't think I want to use the visitor here. Hmm, all these shields are awkward. No matter which way I go, I have to go out of my way a bit. To the left is probably faster. Unless I can get this. Go to the right. I can try to get the crate, but that's real awkward. I do have extra crash beams. So I'm fine with spending one on you and then another on you. I still have three extreme range crash beams, which should be more than enough for ship three. Uh, I'm trying to think of what I want to leave behind. This is target fleas. Target fleas up here. Which means they'll be walking this way, which puts them closer to there. I don't think I need to worry about that. If I steal this key, then there's nothing to worry about. So if I set off the alarm really early, I can catch them over here. And have one less item. Uh, you know, I'm just going to do something. 
Let's see. I'm right here. I'm gonna bet it on this. All right. We're gonna we're gonna just do something. I'll leave this behind. Don't think I'll need it. Leave this behind. Don't think I'll need it. Okay, so we're gonna set off the alarm. And then see... I'm not sure if this crashing part extends while the door is closed. You can't see it while it's closed. So let's see if this works, and if not, I've got a backup plan. It works? Alright. My backup plan... Actually, would that have even worked? Uh, I think that would have worked. My backup plan was to visit here, get the key, and then get the crate. Okay. Now, just so that I don't have to worry about getting shot, crash you. And then go Jew. Jew. Did I get stopped? I got stopped. Now we'll go Jew. And Jew. And I'll pick up one gun so I can shoot targets and fuel barrels and stuff. And then I think I want to. I think I want to leave through this. I uh, should I keep the crash beam? Hmm. We'll see how this goes. Key here. That I can't shoot this too early. I should I should have taken the extreme range crash beam. Oh well. Uh, this will probably be fine. This will probably be fine. And if not, then it's not fine, and then we panic. Worst case scenario, I can use the visitor. Let's see, not there yet. Okay, and then we will shoot you. All right, we're perfect, we're perfect. And we have a subverter. All right. And we just need to wait for this to explode. And, uh, okay, let's, uh, activate this. All right, there we go. Make sure I don't get pulled into that. All right. And there we go. Could have gotten one more item if we took a little bit more time, but yeah, that's fine. We've got a good set. Alright, couple wrenches. Don't think I'll need them. We've got armored guards. Alright, so we can go fast. That actually makes me want to pick up a wrench. Oh boy, that makes me want to pick up a wrench. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. We have everything we need. Okay, okay. Do we... So... The regular gun's not going to be helpful to us. At least not very helpful. Oh, we have exactly what we need. Okay, take this and replace... Oh, we don't need a crash beam. <laughs> or we don't need a crash beam with zero charges, I should say. Okay. 
All right, this is perfect. It's time to do some old fashioned bash dashing. Okay, we've got a secondary door here. We can definitely get in with the subverter, possibly get in with the key cloner. Definitely get in with the visitor and a key cloner, but that's probably not gonna do that. Um Yeah, it's probably worth it. I didn't notice any contractors. I think defenders are what we would have to be careful about the most for our strategy here. Okay. Yeah, key cloner's not gonna work with that, but we have the subverter. And subvert, get the key, we'll have to be a bit careful. And then, uh, that's a bit of a mess. Oh well, we will do what we can. Or is there a place that we really want a subverter? Nope, we're going right along next to Keys the whole way, so we're good here. Oh, and we've got Emergency Shield. That is very good for us. Okay. It's time for some fun. I'm gonna... I don't think I'll need a crash beam. I'm going to leave... One of the conk hammers here. Oh, wait, we already used the subverter, so let's, let's replace that first. Okay, so this is a good time to start with the emergency shield. And then we'll bash you to slow... Oh, you just hit your friend. I forgot they can do that. I forgot to grab the key, I forgot to grab the key. That's actually quite bad. Because you can shoot this fuel barrel. Um, I wasn't thinking about that. Okay, uh, let's uh, shoot you over here. Okay, this isn't the end of the world. This isn't the end of the world. We can still get through like this. I think. I'm not actually sure if this will work. Okay, it worked, it worked. <laughs> I'm a genius. <laughs> I love this. I love this so much. Um, I'm not sure if this will actually slow you down. Yeah, doesn't work like the wrench. Having a second wrench actually would have been helpful here. That shotgun is too loud. No, I missed! Alright, well, con camera I think will be fine here. Just 
have uh, less control over the angle with the conk hammer than the shotgun. So with the two hammers, it, that makes it a bit easier. Alright, gonna have to deal with that whole group in a second. But we've got the shield, so it should be fine. I love this so much. Okay, I think I can abandon you now. I'm about halfway through the shotgun blast. Keep that in mind. Yeah, I was hoping I could get past. Okay, no engines to worry about blowing up here. Let's go ahead and use a shield before it's too late. Or potentially too late. to a nice spot. Blast you down. Wrench you to slow down and open the door. Yep, going a bit off course there. Through that uh, by accident. Eh, I can ignore you now. We'll just take a bit of time and get down here. We still got a bit of shield left. Let's see if I can just get one of them. There we go. This is still taking a lot of time, but it's fun and funny. This is a really risky place to try and maneuver you and seeing. Okay, that worked. All right, that should lead you right along. Uh, trying to get to you. And then we can use our last emergency shield. Get you to stop walking away like a coward. And then we can probably visit... I'm going to try this. Walk up here a bit, visit, give you the old bash, and then shorter bash, and then shot. Now I technically could have just destroyed that fuel barrel. That might have been a decent option. 
But we're already doing this. This is looking good, looking good. All right, and we've got you nice and slowed down. And we shoot out the window and we'll catch you because we can, making sure that I'm in there. All right. I'm curious how much time that actually saved me, but if nothing else, it's a lot of fun. All right, that is all for today. Well, no, I need to look at the other scoreboards first. Currently in first, we'll see how it ends up. Um, yesterday, with the 470, we got in first place. I know at least a 475 was possible. I'm not sure about a 480, though. Maybe, maybe. Um, but we came in first place with the style of horse. Or score of 470, time of a minute and 11 seconds, 111. We have JPEG Dog in second, Rond in third, Umbretto in fourth, and Lee Spork in fifth. Good job, everybody. And with that, that is the end of today's daily challenge, Challenge Saturday. And yes, as always, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you tomorrow.